Welcome to the video abstract of the Bioassays article Peptidyl Prolyl Isomerases Protein Folders or SCAF Folders The example of FKBP51 and FKBP52 Protein folding is an essential step in the flow of information from genes to fully functional proteins. The information of the three-dimensional structure of proteins is fully contained in the amino acid sequence. The majority of proteins spontaneously reach their fully folded state in the absence of further assistance. Some proteins, however, require the action of molecular chop routes. So-called folding catalysts are thought to expedite individual steps shaping the conformation of proteins. Among the folding catalysts, peptidyl prolyl isomerases (PPIases) accelerate the transition between the cis and the trans configuration of peptidyl prolyl bonds. This enzymatic activity could be established in vitro for several proteins, including the family of FK506 binding proteins, the FKBPs. When this activity was discovered, it appeared highly plausible, if not self-understood, that catalyzed isomerization of polyl bonds in proteins is an essential part of folding proline-containing proteins. However, this concept turned out difficult to prove. This review largely focuses on the FKBPs 51 and 52 to discuss the hypothesis that the main function of PPIases is protein scaffolding rather than isomerization of peptidyl bonds. The review details several examples where the original conclusion of the requirement of the enzymatic PPIase activity had to be corrected because mutant PPIase defective proteins affected the function of other proteins in the same way as wild-type PPIases. In parallel, more and more studies report interaction of PPIases with a broad range of different proteins. These studies portray PPIases as protein scaffolders that promote the interaction of other proteins. Therefore, the hypothesis is put forward that PPIases interact with proline-containing protein domains. In some cases, this interaction lowers the activation energy for the transition between the cis and trans configuration of the proline bonds. This, however, is a side effect of protein binding. The main effect of PPIases is promoting the interaction of other proteins through scaffolding thereby changing their function. Enjoy reading.